Hello everyone, it's Coach Carmen, founder of Sharing the Bliss and the Church Health Reform and Wellness Mission, the 28 Day Body and Soul Detox and all that other good stuff. <laughs> I'm here today because it's day number five of our 30 Days of Health to Wealth video series and I just wanted to share with you a tip that I think is going to really bless you. I had a full day, it is late, but I wanted to make sure that I followed through and did this video today. I am looking forward to this yummy bubble bath I have waiting for me with essential oils and I can truly use it. I am doing this, this 30 day video series on the heels of my telesummit which is rounding out and closing up but then actually tomorrow's the last day and after tomorrow we have our closing ceremony on Friday so today is Wednesday July 30th uh, 2014 and today we had Linda Hollander the, the wealthy bag lady and I call her the queen of corporate sponsorships because she teaches you how to get corporate sponsors to fund your business and your dreams it was an honor and a privilege to have her at the um, to have her as a leader teacher today sharing her knowledge and uh, you know just to be able to give out that information to to introduce her to the kingdompreneurs and everyone in my community was just a thrill to be able to share some information that I know is so, so vitally important. And where do you get this information? I mean, it's not everybody's sharing how to get corporate sponsors. Most people have no clue that they could even consider having a corporation fund their business. So, um, Telesummit has been amazing. Tomorrow, my keynote speaker, David Shermer, who's also my mentor and friend from the movie The Secret, will be teaching. So, you still have time to listen to some great stuff, I'm telling you really, really great stuff, and get the gifts from the speaker boxes that's on the official website. So, all you have to do is scroll down. I'm going to make sure I have the. Um, the opt-in link for you so you can opt in for the telesummit but tonight I just wanted to talk to you briefly about something I believe that will help you in every area of your life whatever you're going through spiritually emotionally uh, physically business issues family issues and that is listening to or watching any programming well word-based programming before you go to bed. Now, I am a, a, a woman who enjoys going to bed and, and watching something in the bed. You know, they say, oh, we don't watch TV in the bed, whatever. You know, that's not me. I grew up with this uh, comfort of watching TV at night in my bed because my parents used to do that and I remember as a child laying in, in my room and I could hear the TV on in, in their bedroom and I remember that feeling of just comfort knowing that my parents were in their room com and, and they were comfortable, cozy, in the bed and they were um, listening to television I knew they were safe and that just gave me a, a sense of comfort and security and so that's why I adapted that that habit and my parents passed on very young my, my mother was 41 um, as you know my father was in his early 50s so I, I think that's kind of something that I, I do as a way to, of just bringing back those comfort comfort memories so when the Holy Spirit started to to encourage me to start to listen to or watch ministries and um, and listen to CDs that were that had scriptures because I have some like I have Kenny Copeland's um, scriptures uh, CD where he's all the scriptures um, he's 
sharing are on wealth, and then I have one with Gloria, Gloria Copeland, uh, my spiritual god, my spiritual mom, and she is speaking on the, the CD. She's actually sharing healing scriptures. So the Holy Spirit made me understand how important it was to make sure that when I'm laying down, I'm feeding my mind the Word of God. And in doing that, it actually starts to recalibrate my, my brain cells and it starts to align my whole being with the kingdom of God. We're healing, wholeness, wellness, um, every up-leveled experience of life is in the kingdom and when you are aligned with when you are listening to the word of god hearing scriptures and hearing the word being taught at night you are aligning your body your mind your emotions and every area of your being every part of your being with the kingdom of god and when you are aligned with the kingdom of God, you are aligned with the healing, with the ease. Your soul gets comforted. All of a sudden, you wake up and instead of feeling the angst in the morning, you, you ever get that? The angst in the morning, you know, you have so much to do. You're still thinking about what you didn't do yesterday and how, what do you have to do to put out a fire from yesterday, today? And you wake up with all of this craziness in your head you will find when you start to listen to or watch programming that's word-based at night that all of those those crazy emotions will start to just wave and just go away and you'll feel yourself waking up with so much more calm you'll find yourself having more ideas and try to snap my fingers with my right hand <laughs> I am doing pretty good. Look at that. That's pretty good. <laughs> Healing every day. Amen. Healing every day in the name of Jesus. Praise God. And I'm telling you, listening to the word of God at night is helping to speed up my healing. I find out that I find that in the, at night I'm not in as much pain. I'm telling you, this is a wonderful tip. And as I said, I know if you're like me, you got into this habit of watching other programming. I love Westerns, I love old movies, and I'm, you know, I like watching that kind of stuff at night. But now I've learned to watch that at night, watch one show, and then I'll put in my CD or my, my, my DVD of a ministry and listen to Bill Winston or um, or Creflo or, or somebody or Joyce Meyer or um, Joel Osteen you know listen to them while I'm resting going into sleep mode and I wake up feeling so much better and my whole day is so much better so that's it I can talk about this a whole lot because I so, so believe in recalibrating your brain with the Word of God and stepping into the kingdom by receiving um, that transference of, of bliss that's in the Word and actually becoming blissful because the Word is, is blissful. Amen. All right. So listen, that's it. Have a beautiful night, everyone. And I look forward to seeing you tomorrow.